What's up everybody, what's going on? So we got a video, we got an update going on. We're gonna see what is the parameters looking like for day three. Day three of the aquarium running. As you see, I have a shrimp that's wrapped up in a cloth. That is my uh, source of toxins. As it breaks down and decomposes, it gives the toxins, which uh, shows nitrates, ammonia, you know, all the waste as if it was a fish. It's basically something you do when you want your aquarium to cycle as if you was doing a fish in cycle, which they was being tortured by the ammonia and they was causing the gills to burn and stuff like that. I just figured I'd just torture the heck out of a dead shrimp I was going to eat for dinner. I went ahead and took it out of my freezer. It's an old school method. It's been going on for uh, three days now ever since I had a tank set up. As well as I have a pellet of Norfin sitting there decomposing. As you see, it's all fuzzy and all that nice stuff. That's how you like it to get all fuzzy buzzy. Hello, and it's breaking down. Look like somebody took a bite of it, but as we know, there's nothing in the aquarium but that live rock right there. It's beautiful. And it's three pieces. Uh, maybe uh, 15 pounds. I don't know. It's pretty heavy. But uh, let's go ahead and see what the parameters is like. This tank is fully cycled. Not fully cycled, but it's cycled to the point where I'm very happy at where I'm seeing in three days from this method. But I can't give all the credit to my little cheap DIY method of shrimp and pellets. Also, I've been using the Bio Spira. Now, it's by Instant Ocean as well. You know, I've been using the natural uh, Pacific Ocean water here. The five gallons method. It's pretty good. Um, and the live sand. My carob see here. Also, uh, if you want to know where did I get this tank from, hey baby girl, baby girl, let me see. It was from Saltwater uh, Aquarium dot com. Sales at Saltwater Aquarium, Saltwater Aquarium eight 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 seven hundred ten twelve. But let's go ahead and move along to this video because my daughter is wanting to speak to her daddy. So in this video we will look at here. Let's get some light on. Maybe we can see what's going on a little better. These are parameters. And yes, this is a freshwater test kit. But as you know, salt water and uh, fresh water and the, the, the test kits are pretty much the same. Except it doesn't have that low pH. It's always high pH. So it's one, two, three, four columns. But the PPMs, part per million, and everything is the same. But look at this, you guys. I'm excited. So we got this right here. We got the ammonia showing here. And look at that. We got 2.0 in ammonia. It's freaking amazing. We got ammonia on day three. We got 80 parts per million on nitrates on day three. We have nitrite showing all the way down to 5 ppm. It's going crazy. And we have the pH. And that's at 8.2. Yikka D. Thank you for watching, you guys. That's day three of this cycle. Yikka D. Stay tuned. Holla. Yikka D.